Hey guys, Sock here from Sock e Ticket. In today's video, what we're going to do is we are going to show you how to check to see if your Samsung Galaxy smartphone's OLED display has screen burning or not. So if you do have a Samsung Galaxy smartphone, that phone should not have any screen burn in. It is simply annoying. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys exactly how to check to make sure there is none of that on your phone. Now this trick is going to apply to Samsung phones with OLED displays. Now first and foremost, if you want to download this wallpaper right here that I just showed in the very beginning of the video, this one right here, I'm going to drop a link down below, okay? It's going to be a free wallpaper as of now. So click the link, it's going to take you to the website, the link's going to be down below. Scroll down just a little bit and it's wallpaper number one, the blue circuit wallpaper. You click the link, it'll take you to the Galaxy Wallpaper Store, and you can in fact download this wallpaper for free by clicking over here. It's a fantastic wallpaper. Now let's get started with the screen burning. So the very first thing that you want to do is you want to go to your settings. This is just the preparation phase. So you want to go to your display. You want to make sure adaptive brightness or auto brightness is in fact turned off. So turn that off and then maximize the screen brightness of your smartphone. I'm going to adjust the brightness of the camera so you can see what's happening here, but make sure you max that brightness out. All right, so that's all good to go. We have maximum brightness. Now what you want to do is you want to launch your phone dialer. So simply go to your phone application and go into the keypad, and here's the code you want to put in. So what you want to do is you want to tap on star, number, zero, star, number. Now, once you do that, what's going to happen is you are going to be dumped into a diagnostic menu that's built in in most Samsung smartphones. And the only portion that you are going to be concerned about is going to be the, the top row right over here, where it says red, green, and blue. You don't have to worry about anything else over here. So here's step number one. Step number one, you want to tap on the red, okay? Now, as soon as you tap on the red, the whole screen is be going to become completely red. Once it is red, all you want to do is you want to inspect it very carefully to look for four to five things. You want to look for any uneven color. So in my case, I have a solid red and it is consistent throughout the entire display. You also want to look for any kind of darker shade. So if there's a little bit dark shade over here or over here or over here or anywhere on the screen, if it's a little bit darker, uh, then the rest of the display, the red display, then you have a problem. That means you have a screen burn in. If you have uneven colors, there's going to be a screen burn in. And the biggest thing that you want to look for is if there's any static images that you can see burned into the display. In this case, mine is crystal clear, which is expected because this is a brand new smartphone. And one of the biggest things you want to look for, the next thing is you want to look for dead pixels. So if there's any black areas on the phone, other than obviously the punch hole camera, if you see any black spots, that those are dead pixels, and that's also not good. Okay, so in my case, the red is perfect. So I'm gonna, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, uh, I just tapped on it to go back. So if you're in the red color, you tap to go back. Now you do the same thing with green. So what you want to do is, again, look for uneven color tones, uh, you want to make sure there's no dark shades of uh, 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 green in there. In my case, it's crystal clear, no static images, no dead pixels, nothing happening here. So that's good as well. Okay, and then tap again. And now you want to go to blue. Once you're in the blue, you want to do the same thing. Inspect it very carefully. And I highly recommend grabbing a microfiber cloth and just cleaning the display as you're inspecting it to make sure you don't confuse uh, fingerprint smudges uh, for any kind of imperfections. So remember, no matter what color you're in, everything has to be nice and even, okay? If I'm in red, it has to be nice and even. Once you confirm that in all these three colors, you're done. You do not have screen burn in. Now, if you do have screen burn in, you can check your warranty and you can contact Samsung, maybe get a replacement or maybe go to a store that allows you to replace your display. But that's it. Now, once you're here, uh, I recommend not touching any one of these other buttons here. If you want to do it, that's up to you. I recommend don't do it right now. Uh, but once you're done with this whole thing, all you do is double press the back button and that's going to exit that diagnostic menu and you are going to be dumped back into uh, your phone dialer and you are back in business. 
hopefully there's no problems with your phone and you are good to go now also again like i said if you want to grab this wallpaper okay it's a gorgeous wallpaper free right now uh simply click the link down below and just download that for free any questions comments or concerns drop them down below let me know for now guys have a fantastic day i hope you guys enjoyed this video all right so if you found this video useful make sure to subscribe to saki tech by clicking that button and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time i upload a new video and if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.